everyone, this is Sean. I am super excited because just yesterday I was invited to do something that I've been wanting to do for a long time and that is trying out the Microsoft HoloLens, okay? It blew my mind and although I was not allowed to take any photos or videos, I definitely am super excited to share my experiences. I really wanted to make this video showing exactly what it looks like inside and it actually is pretty challenging to make a video like this. This is definitely the closest depiction of what it looks like inside HoloLens uh, compared to anything else that I found online and uh, it's pretty cool. Okay, so while we're on for special effects might as well have me join in as well. So you can see the field of view, it's not it doesn't cover your peripheral vision, it doesn't cover your whole vision. It's more like a, a, a view box right in the middle of uh, your vision. And outside of the view box, you can still see your surroundings. And actually, you can see your surroundings inside the view box as well, but you can only see the holograms inside the view box. Um, outside of the view box, there are some artifacts like a diffraction or refraction. You can see some kind of like almost like a rainbow color type thing going on. So what what did they do really well? Well, first of all, virtually no lag. Like I tried to trip this thing up. I was looking fast, I was looking up and down, I was moving to the side, I was kind of looking all around and the holograms perfectly matched the background. When something was stuck on the wall, when the hologram was stuck on the wall, it actually was stuck on the wall. I could not make it move from where it was. And I was really impressed by that. Uh, there was also, at the very beginning, there was a scanning feature where you walked all the way around and it scanned the surroundings. And you could actually see the environment according to how HoloLens sees it. It doesn't get every nook and cranny and it doesn't scan every nuance like that, but pretty good. It got the, the major objects in the room, uh, you know, it was able to detect the walls, it was able to detect the, the furniture in the room. So that was epic. And just the experience itself, I found that even though the field of view wasn't expanded all the way to, for example, my peripheral vision, I was really sucked in. You kind of forget that you're wearing something, you forget that you're looking at a screen, you're, you're really sucked into this, the hologram environment, and that was really really cool. I, so I so I do think yes even though you know there's this uh, field of vision that everyone talks about it's it's actually an it's not that big of an issue. Of course it'd be epic if it was in your peripheral vision but I think that they did a really good job. Okay so there you have it that was my video. Uh, feel free to ask me any questions about my experience. This was really the the tip of the iceberg. I had some really good conversations with the developers. The demo itself was about 10 minutes long so you know a, a really good amount of time. So you know, let me know if you have any questions. Uh, otherwise, what I show here in my video, uh, as far as what I've looked and looked and looked, this is the most accurate, best depiction of if you were to put on the HoloLens, what it would actually look like. So hopefully you uh, enjoyed this video. Uh, if it was helpful, please uh, hit the like button. Uh, if you haven't already, do subscribe, share, and thank you very much for watching.